So I don't have a very typical day because as a uh, freelance producer, every day is completely different. Um, but if it's a day that I'm working on a movie and I'm on set, I would usually get up um, very early because we tend to film at the crack of dawn um, or some or you're shooting at night. And so it's very late. But if it's a, if it's an early day or getting up at the crack of dawn, um, leaving the house, getting to set, getting coffee, and then usually I'll sit down with the director and the first AD, talk through the schedule for the day. Um, and then I try to just identify anything that might, uh, any problems that might come up early if I can. So if I can see that it's a very tight schedule for the day, I'm trying to think about what scenes will be the difficult ones to film and what I might do to help everybody prepare for those a little bit. Um, some days on set, it goes perfectly smoothly and I really don't have to do anything but be there. Um, other days, it's constantly putting out fires and, and sort of chasing your tail to make sure that you get caught up and stay on schedule. Um, sometimes you can't film a scene for whatever reason and you're tr already thinking about how you're going to fit that into the schedule next week. So um, it can really range from being a very um, challenging day where I'm on the phone a lot or um, running around or sometimes I'm sitting in a chair all day just sort of watching the magic happen. So typically um, it's on set I'm sitting in what they call Video Village, um, which is chair and a monitor and um, watching each scene be filmed. Sometimes I'll talk to the director before if there are specific things I want to make sure that um, we convey. Typically the director is in charge of the speaking to the actors and but um, I might give that person notes um, about what I'm thinking and then it's just watching each scene be filmed making sure that um, we're communicating what we need to in the script. Uh, making sure enough time is spent, but not too much time, so they're kind of keeping an overall eye on the schedule. Um, a lot of times it's having meetings with each department head throughout the day, so checking in with uh, the production designer and their team to make sure that the sets looking forward are ready, um, just solving any problems as they come up. And, and typically it's things later in the schedule, so I'm not always focusing on what's happening that day as much as I'm thinking ahead to what's going to be happening throughout the week. Um, and then at the end of the day, a lot of times we will convene with the crew, again, just to, to look ahead in the schedule and go, what challenges do we see coming up? What um, effects are going to be really difficult to pull off? And can we talk through how to do that? Um, sometimes I'm filming an audition of a dog <laughs> while, while the scene is going on or doing something else that, again, will be shot later on down the line, but I'm looking ahead to, to what holes need to be filled later in the schedule. So, um, And then just any issues that come up with the crew. Um, I do a lot of answering gripes. So <laughs> it's, you know, if people have anything to complain about, I'm the complaint department. They can come to me. I try to be a, a welcome uh, sort of person for that. If, if somebody needs to talk through an issue with me, I'm, I'm always there to listen and, and try to resolve it. 